Welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be doing episode 1 in a Minecraft series. My friend set up a realm and he invited me to it and we just started things off yesterday. Now as you see over there in the distance this is my area in the desert and we have a desert village right by us which is awesome. Now as you can tell my inventory is pretty loaded because I raided a couple other villages while I was on my way to here. This area is actually like 2,000 blocks away from the spawn, but it's fine. We have a ton of sand by us. I think that's good enough. Yeah. Anyway, I'll show you guys my house. Basically nothing so far. Just this weird thing that I created, but yeah. So I just smelted some smooth sandstone. I tried out a little bit of regular sandstone but yeah this definitely looks much better than sandstone yeah i'm going to see i made a little bit more smooth sandstone i'm gonna just finish this side up and see if it looks good um just a second yeah that definitely looks really much better i like it so i'm gonna do it for all four sides see oh my what was that oh my baby husk ah no god how much health does this thing have jeez is this world on hard mode oh my it's only the second day and it's on hard mode this is unbelievable no come back here come back here mm. Okay, uh, let me break that block. Yep, go back in there. You are my first villager. Deal with it. Yep. Okay, now he is trapped. Anyway, I did a little bit of off-the-screen work. And yeah, I said I was going to continue this color combination. I really like it, and this is what I have so far. Our villager Larry is still there. And let me guys give you a small tour of my house. I know that it's kind of small, but I actually prefer smaller houses. It just saves space. And I kind of just like the look of smaller houses. So that's the bed on the bottom. We've got our chests on the first floor. Um, Now we got the food in that. Now we have a second floor right here. I haven't added anything to it yet, but that's our second floor. And then our third floor. Now this floor is probably not going to be used too much. It's probably going to be my um, archer's tower kind of. You know from Clash, right, or Clash of Clans. I can use my bow or something from there. Not going to be very useful. Or it could be like my elytra area if I get an elytra. But I said I was thinking of doing a little bit of raiding. I know you guys would probably like that. But I don't know if it's a good idea because... Um, there's not very many people on the server, or the realm, and the person nearby died six times, so he probably doesn't have anything, and then the other guy is extremely far away. Jeez, really? Uh, this hard mode is really just annoying me a lot now. So many husks, that's an extreme downside. Uh, what are you doing, boy? Yeah, just, just die, please. Hmm, I think it just collected a husk head. What, oh, what was that? What is that? Oh god, creep. Uh, well, that's weird. Can't t touch it, it's just an arrow suspended in the air. That's weird. So yeah, I kind of moved some of my stuff from outside. I put some furnaces on the first floor. I moved some of the materials. I think I'm looking pretty good. I'm still deciding what I want to do with the second and third floor. Well, I kind of already have an idea for the third floor, but second floor, I guess I could just use as extra storage or other stuff for maybe a farm. Of course, I'm not...
Okay, so we got our nether portal set up uh, by a fellow member of the realm and I kind of added some designs to it so it kind of matches the theme of the desert. Now, I'll just go ahead and go into it. It's all linked up so that I should be able to come back. And I also got the house. I think I go to the right to go to the hub of the nether. So while I was working on the house, I decided to make a group called the Drifters. And it's kind of just a cult. I don't know why I created it, but felt that it would be good so that we could attack others or just work together. Okay, so let's go to the house to discuss our plans. Hmm. Oh, another village. Oh, okay, let's see. We got the creator. BRB Hawk is the creator of the realm. And then Jack Attack is the first official member other than me, the Drifters. And then there's uh, BRB Hawk is uh, the group, is part of the group called the Cat Killers because he has a cat head right here. But that's just a name that we have for him. Yes, yes, yes. Um, <laughs> okay. So let's see, we got like five people in the realm. I think it's a good time to discuss our plans on what we should do to the other people that aren't a part of the drifters. So, okay, let's go to the meeting room. Where's the meeting room? So me and Jack Attack discussed some plans for the drifters. We made a small meeting room here, um, yeah, as you can see. And so we kind of discussed what we were planning on to do with this group called the drifters, like how we're going to do what we're going to do in the future in the realm. What else we're going to do? So we discussed, we had a pretty good meeting and we had a good idea of what we're going to do as the drifters. And so yeah, Jack attacked and another person also joined the drifters. So right now there is currently three members of the drifters. I think it's a very uh, growing group. So I think it's going to become a pretty strong group. But I feel like war is going to be coming soon. I don't know why, but I feel like it's becoming war-like. Now, this guy right here is part of the cat killers and this will be an example of what happens to the cat killers <laughs> oh my gosh guys we have a intruder so actually uh, a couple minutes ago i actually killed this guy two times okay blow my um unfortunately you didn't pass the test we gave you a couple of questions i asked you um how you like to live um, if you killed a cat, what you like to do, and other things, and uh, the drifters didn't feel you were suitable for this task. We thought that you did not pass the test. You only got 25% correcting. What is drifting? See, as a person that doesn't know what drifting is, we feel that you're not suitable for the drifters, and that's why- Oh my- Yeah! Stop! I'm almost dead! Uh. No, he's chasing me. No, no. That's it. The cat killers will be killed, will be burnt to the ground. Need to go. Oh my. Stop! Go <laughs> if you want me to come and kill the cat killers. Oh! Guys! Ah! 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 No! The cat killers! They're attacking me! No! No! Wait, just a second. I'm gonna- I'm gonna- Oh, so you can- This. This. Ay! No, the ah! shovel. No, I need to run. Don't run, I'm coming. Oh, let me get in. The, let me get inside. No. No. Oh, okay. I kind of deserve that. Let's just move on. Okay. So these are the people of the realm, 
Um, we've got about eight people here, and they're all part of... Well, we have separated into different factions, whether they have liked it or not. Now, we have three separate factions right now. We have the Drifters, which I am the leader of. We have the Cat Killers, which BRB Hawk is the leader of. And we have the uh, Potatoes, which is this guy right here. He is the leader. Now, we have decided to... <laughs> okay, well, that's... Oh, sorry. I want to decide on a peace agreement. Uh, <laughs> because there's a lot of war going on. And I think that we should be in peace for a couple of days since we're all starting out and this is a pretty new world. So I think we should all be in a peace peace for a little bit before we go to war. Uh, um, please um, s uh, sit in the fire if you agree to have peace for a couple of days and not attack each other. So please sit in the fire. Okay. Everybody except... Oh, oh, oh my gosh! Pull out war! Ah! Uh, uh. Enough! Stop! You're about to kill me! Ah! Uh. Ah! Uh. <laughs> no! We're at... Heck. Kill him! No... Most of the fighting has stopped, but oh my gosh, these ruthless killers are just trying to kill everybody. Gosh, this innocent, <laughs> they're just killing innocent people now. The war is, oh gosh, no. Anyway guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, we're coming at to an end. If you guys did enjoy this video, please don't forget to like. The more likes I get, the more support, and the faster I'll be able to release the next videos. So please like comment don't forget to subscribe that's important too um i'd actually like to thank everybody because now the dosa god channel is at 50 subscribers of course it's not a lot but it definitely means a lot to me because i just didn't start the channel too long ago and i'm at 50 subscribers so i'm really happy for that um thank you everybody who's supported me so far and i hope this channel becomes good in the future i hope i get a get continue a great community uh, once again, thank you, everybody, and have a great rest of your day.